Good morning, everyone. Yolancey Peterson here. Today it is Friday, October 11th, 2019. It is 1118 AM and I am in Hollywood, California. I don't like work in Hollywood that much, but here I am. And today I got a great free meal courtesy of Postmates from Wendy's. So I'm gonna tell you what the food was, what the food is, and then I'm gonna tell you how the story went down. So um, the customer ordered $24.70 worth of food. Um, and I tell you, I, I, I got too much here. I gotta, I gotta start, um, I got a little, little pantry here and give away some food to a couple of people. Um, so I've got, man, they, they, they hooked me up. And y'all gonna love the story, I guarantee you. That's why I had to do it. Okay, so I have a, um, I have a, um, what's this thing? It's a half salad here, a Parmesan half sal half sa salad with, you know, with, um, with grilled chicken, um, spicy Parmesan strips, Caesar salad. It looks awesome. I, I can't wait to eat this salad. I'm, I'm gonna, you know, and I, and I, I brought plenty of napkins and forks because I figured they were gonna share this. Then I have a, um, I have an awesome bacon cheeseburger. I have a, um, I have a double stack um, bacon burger and I have a spicy chicken Asiago sandwich. And I've had this sandwich before and this sandwich is great. Hey man, you asked me for food earlier? No, I didn't. Okay. I thought that was the guy that asked me for food earlier. So, so here's the story. I got I got twenty four dollars. Well, the, 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 the subtotal was twenty two dollars and fifty six cents, and then with taxes it came to two dollars and fourteen cents. So I got twenty four dollars and seventy cents worth of food. So this is this is how it went down. <laughs> I'm getting over a little head thing going on here. I decide to do a little bit of Postmates today. They're guaranteeing $70 if you do 10 trips. I like, okay, you know what? I'm getting eight miles to the gallon in this truck, but I can handle 10 trips, no problem. This was trip number five, as a matter of fact. It only took me three hours to do it. I'm like, okay, this feels pretty good. So I'm doing my trips, everything is going, everything is cool, and then I get a trip going to, um, to Wendy's. I'm like, okay, great, no problem. It's, it's right down the street from um, from Chick Fil A because I just finished dropping off someone some food at Chick Fil A. I come to the Wendy's, I pick up the food, and then they want me to drive all this food from the Chick Fil A from from Wendy's on on um, in Culver City, basically at the 10 Freeway and um, where Venice and the 10 Freeway intersect. And they want me to drive it all the way up to Hollywood and Vine. The trip was like 27 minutes. And I was scheduled to get here at 1046. I got here at 1048. So the first thing I have to do is I got to find a spot to park. I find a spot to park and I walk about five minutes to the apartment complex. Then they give all these complicated instructions to get to the apartment. They say, first come to the front door. Then when you get to the front door, you have to walk upstairs to the second level, hook a left, go past the, go past the, um, the swimming pool, get in the elevator, go up to the third floor, then walk to the apartment. I go to the apartment. I go to the front door. I ring the doorbell. A minute passes, nobody comes to the front door. I ring it again, about 30 seconds happens. I hear some people moving around in there, but no one comes to the front door. Ring, ring. I wait another 30 seconds, no one comes to the front door. I call the customer. It goes to voicemail. I send two text messages, Postmates is here, Postmates is here. No response. I call again. It goes to voicemail. Ring, ring. No one comes to the door. 
then someone I hear someone come to the door and step to it and look out the door. I'm like, what in the world is going on? I send a message to Postmates and say, hey, unable to contact customer. I get a five minute, um, I get a five minute um, um, countdown. Um, so I, I step back, I lean against the wall. They can see me and the food clearly and nothing. The final 30 seconds of the wait, I ring the doorbell again. I call the customer again, goes to voicemail, nothing. Postmates comes up and says, hey, unable to contact the customer, dispose of the food as you see fit. Now, when I left, when I left my vehicle, there was a there was an urban gentleman right here and he was saying, hey, um, do you have any leftovers? And I'm like, you know what, sir, I'm sorry, but I don't I don't have any leftovers. It's a customer order for Postmates. And you know, the funny thing is. I, I come back up here and I'm looking for the guy because I'm like, dude, I got, I got, I got extras now. I, I got, I, I was going to, I was going to hook him up and I was going to give him the spicy chicken Asiago sandwich. Um, but he, he, he isn't here. He left his, he left his coat behind and I thought the guy was walking. I thought, I thought he was the guy cause they were, they were dressed the same and they look roughly the same. It's just the urban guy was laying on the, on the side of the building and you know I, I was like hey I was gonna give you some give you something because you know he was real cool about it but I tell you this is the third meal I've gotten on or from Postmates and customers that for some reason could, could just give away twenty three twenty four dollars and seventy cents worth of food and the, and the great thing was I, I got eight dollars and seventy six cents from this deal so um, hey I did everything possible. I'm going to have a fascinating day today. I got five more trips to do to get that 70 bucks because I needed, um, I needed for the, um, I needed for the gas and, um, I wanted to try something a little different today and, um, you know, we'll see, but, um, I'm, I'm, I see Postmates for what it is. Postmates is, is something where I know if I do the work with Postmates, I can make 150 bucks a day with Postmates and, and, you know, be a little more, you know, free will. I like the exercise. The exercise was great. I mean, I'm, I got my heart rate up. I got a little bit of a sweat going on. And, um, you know, I got to go to this apartment complex and they, it looks like they want about 2,800 a month for a one bedroom in the place. It's nice. It's really nice. All right. Um, I'll catch y'all in the next video. I got a couple of other things to talk about. Um, but hey, that's how it is so far. Have a good one, everyone. Take care.